everybody. I'm the executive director, administration, and of docs, CIFAS group. So, what is your relationship with the Taliban? Oh, that's my brother, my friend, my mentor, my leader, my chairman. I can keep calling his name now and now and now. If you start now till tomorrow, even till next year, you can't finish. This is somebody who's so humble. Even with his status, he's very humble. He's very tolerating. How will I even describe him? He's a man who sees vision, who sees ahead. He's a man of a foresight. And this man, if I have to describe him, I will talk from now to tomorrow. Because he's somebody who is so heartwarming. Despite his position as the chairman of the company, he takes everybody as one. He makes sure you grow on the job. If you don't understand the job, he's somebody who can describe, who can tell you how to go about it. But at the same time, don't take him for granted. It's very disciplined. Okay. It's very disciplined. And it's very, very. Uh, how would I say it? It's is 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 a very unique leader. Even though it takes nonsense, it takes no no, no nonsense. But he knows his onions. He knows that he has to keep his people around him. He knows to make them grow. You know, and as he progresses, the company also progresses. Wonderful. And I pray that. He will live to live twice his age on earth today. He's always a jolly good fellow, always fun to be with, even at work and outside work. Like I said, he's a brother, he's a friend, uh, he's a mentor. So I'm, I'm always happy being with him, T, even with the family. You know, we blend very easily. He's a man that everybody wants to be here. He's a father of the nation. So what, do you, what are the prayers you have for the celebrant today on his birthday? that God will continue to protect him, grant him long life and good health, and he will live to see 70, 80, 90, and 100 in very good health. Tumba Femi Karina is my name. What do you today? He's my friend, my brother of so many years, and uh, we have to come rejoice with him today because he's a joke about anybody, and uh, He's happy with everybody, and he's always in that mood, you know. So, for us, we just come to rejoice with him, no other thing. I feel fulfilled. I feel fulfilled because uh, what you see is what you get. What you are looking at is Taiwa Falabi, and uh, that's exactly who he is. And uh, if I am not here today, I will feel bad, I will feel terrible as a uh, joyful human being as he is. It's only natural for me to be here, celebrate with him, and join his well wishes all over the world to rejoice with him and uh, to celebrate with him. That's just kind of why I'm here. To give him so many more years on earth, he will see his uh, children, children, in good health, in wealth, and most especially with joy and happy family. That's our prayers for him. Good health. Can I say, you've interviewed so many people, and I'm sure they, say they, will, they will have told you exactly what I have in mind. And he's such a very nice person, very humble, God fearing. Well, I wish him every, every little thing he. He wishes for himself and much more. Ajini Fuja. No, it's my brother and my friend. Mm, he's a good man. Mm, I came all the way back. It's just to celebrate him. Yeah, it's a good man. What are the things you can say about the celebrant? Many things. Very generous. He's a man of the people. And I wish him long live and more prosperity. So we are looking forward to celebrate the 16th in a very big way than this. Well, to describe Dr. Afolabi is hard. 
So I believe uh, a lot of a lot of words can be said, but he's one of the most generous and humble people I've ever met. Is that enough for me today? I feel being honored to be part of his family and being part of his, his birthday today. Happy birthday, Doc. My name is Idan Bahat. I am Edco, Edco, a general manager. Okay, we have the honor to work with the doctor in a Marriott Ikeja Hotel. Okay, we've implemented the system in the hotel. This is a great project. I think one of the best uh, hotel in Nigeria. Allow me to say, and a great honor to work with the doctor, with uh, Doctor Afolabi. Uh, he's, an, he's, a, he's a great client, and uh, we are doing our best to make him satisfied from the project. And congratulations for his birthday. It's a great. Honor for My name is Benson Chugobo. I'm the executive director of Edco Nigeria Limited. So we are here to celebrate and uh, to wish him many happy birthday returns of his birthday, a long life. He will celebrate and enjoy the fruit of his labor. It's, it's humility. As in, he's, um, he's a calm person. He's not someone you see everywhere. A lot of people say so much about um, his person, and we all always have the same thing to say. He taught us humility, and he's the, I believe he's the best person I've worked with. It makes working with him easy, and he, he teaches us how to, we learn from him. And I wish him the very best, I, and I pray that um, the best of what he wishes will be the least of what he gets. And I pray that all the things he has labored for, may the Lord in his infinite mercies let him live long to enjoy it and it would reap everything he has done and his kids would enjoy the benefit of what he has done to a lot of people that he didn't give birth to but he has in one way or the other helped. I'm the MD of CFAX Logistics, CFAX Idora Causeway, uh, that's it. So what's your relationship with Dr. Barista Taiwan Falabi? Um, well, I'm, I'm, I'm knowing him for a long time, of course, and I work for him since uh, almost a year. Uh, so knowing him is one thing, but working for him is another thing. And I enjoy the relationship what we have, the growth, the potential in the group, and, and the way we are moving forward. So yes, I, I enjoy every minute being there. The small is an example for so many youth and others who try to come up in Nigeria also. He has made it, so if he can do it, I'm sure others can do it also. So I wish him all the best going forward, a lot of health and um, a lot of growth in in the group so well if a doctor with his status can still be with us with some of us that were there with him then it counts for a lot you know if there's anything the man has he has a fear of god He's such a humble man and he cannot stand anybody suffering i've never seen this kind of a man in my life he's always willing to help always willing to impact on people's life it's one in a generation and so we're all happy to celebrate him and we pray that god will grant him long life in good health and sound mind and god will continue to promote him and his family okay my name is ifoma ezibeni and I am the relationship manager from Echo Bank of CFAX So, Like I said earlier, I'm the relationship manager from Echo Bank. And so I'm here on behalf of Echo Bank. And yes, you know, we're related that way. Funny man, he's fantastic. And, um, you know, even though I've known him for not too long, but what I've seen so far, especially you know, in terms of his business, you know, over time, the way it's grown, everything is just skyrocketing. You know, he's an icon in Nigeria. He has, he has provided a lot of employment here and there, and the companies and subsidiaries, they keep expanding. So he's done a lot of great things for Nigeria. And I'm so, so proud to be part of the team. Very, very good. I'm very privileged, you know, to be among the people that came here. I mean, he's a fantastic person, and we all believe in him. 
and like I said, he's a wonderful human being and he has done a lot in Nigeria. So I just want to wish him a happy birthday. We came, I came here on behalf of Echo Bank, even though, yeah, some of us are also here as well, but I came here on behalf of Echo Bank. So on behalf of Echo Bank, sir, I'm saying happy birthday. And we wish you a very, very long life, good health, peace of mind, prosperity in your business. It will keep growing and growing and growing beyond what you can ever imagine. I wish you all the best, sir. Thank you very much. I'm the CEO of Squad Media Group. Wow, my relationship with uh, Barrister Dr. Tawa Falabi is, is more or less like a son to a father. And Dr. Tawa Falabi has been helping, has helped a lot of people, seriously. And, he's, uh, and he, he doesn't stop helping. In fact, I've never seen this kind of man in my life before, seriously. In fact, I'm, I'm, I'm very proud of him. And I, I pray to Almighty Allah to give him long life and good earth. That's all I pray for him. I pray for long life and good earth. May Almighty Allah grant him all his heart desire. He shall be well with Dr. Tawa Afolabi and his amiable wife, Chief Mrs. Afola Shadi Afolabi. Uh, I, 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 an, English, an English word said, uh, behind a successful man, there's a woman behind it. So I give kudos to Chief Mrs. Afolabi for the great job he, uh, she has done in, uh, in the life of my, my father. Seriously, he's my father. Seriously, he's my father. He's my father. I thank God for his life. I thank God for his life. Uh, the celebrant happens to be a brother and a friend and um, a business partner from time to time. <laughs> Dr. Falabi, um, well, uh, I, I would not want to exaggerate much about him, but he's a very good brother, a kind fellow, generous to a fault, very humble, despite uh, everything that God has given to him. He's very down to earth, and um, he's somebody that whenever you're in his company, you just feel uh, very good with yourself. He's never been that person that will just uh, push you away. He's very accommodating and um, a very godly person. Yes, I wish him a very long life and um, good health. He should continue to be generous and God Almighty will continue to re replenish his pocket. Despite everything that he does for everybody, uh, God will enlighten and widen his coast more and more. I'm Femi Telefusi from Houston, Dr. Femi Telefusi. Taiwa Falabi is like a dad, an older brother of my best uncle, best friend. He's everything to me, to tell you the truth. Everything you can imagine he is to me. And for many others is that he doesn't think about himself. He thinks about others. He, he works hard to take care of so many people, to help other people. And I think that's just a blessing and a characteristic that many people don't have that's amazing. That even drew me close to him. If he has anything, he's willing to give it out to anyone. Like me, for example, I'm not his biological son, but he took me like a son. And the impact that he's had on my life is something that I will never ever forget. And it's also encouraged me to be able to do that for others. So um, he's such a blessing. And I really, really greatly, greatly appreciate him in my life and, and the life of the other people. Uh, he has all those principles in him. And I just love him to death, basically. I, I Even from America, we talk almost every day, every other day. So. If I don't hear from him in one or two days, I will call him. He calls me. And uh, he's just a blessing. And I pray that God will continue to bless him, elevate him. And God will continue to celebrate him, celebrate his family. He also has a very lovely family. My name is Dr. Wale Afolabi. I'm the senior brother of the selling brand. I feel great for celebrating with both of them today. Uh, before I came here this afternoon, I was with uh, his twin brother in his hotel, Ken Dallas, to celebrate with him. It was after I left there that I came down here. So I feel great for celebrating with both of them. The selling branch, um, Dr. Taiwo Afolabi, he's a good man. He's uh, a generous man that uh, likes to give to people and um, he's a meticulous person 
and um, at the same time very hard working and I thank God for blessing him and I know God will continue to bless him more and more. He will celebrate many many years in good death and in prosperity. God will continue to guide and protect him. He will not cast his young. God will satisfy him with long life. And God will continue to bless him more and more to his glory in Jesus' name. Yeah, yeah, for him. Um, we're grateful. We thank God for his life. Um, we are happy to be alive to come and celebrate with him another year. That we are happy to be here uh, for another year to celebrate Dr. Taiwa Falabi. Um, uh, I call him a mentor, um, a humanitarian, um, but he's much more than that. Um, he's a friend, he's a brother. And um, given what we went through last year for COVID and what we've been going through so far this year, um, we have to thank God. Um, we have to thank God for our lives. We have to thank God for his life. The, you know, that we must, we must be grateful to God. We are not in the hospital, we are not in the mortuary. Uh, in as much as we don't want to celebrate and have a party, we must still gather and give praise to God and in our own small way be grateful that we are alive. So I'm happy to be here to celebrate another year that God has added to the life of Dr. Taiwa Folabi. Um, we pray that he will continue to live in good health and continue to prosper. And we pray that all the good desires of his heart that God will grant and give him long life and um, keep his children alive, um, keep him alive to see his grandchildren and his great-grandchildren. And um, I'm happy, and I say happy birthday, Dr. Taiwa Falabi. And of course, his twin brother. We must remember that there's also, uh, you know, uh, Chief Kendi Afolabi's birthday as well. So we say happy birthday to the two of them. I'm Mrs. Fola Shade Afolabi. Dr. Taiwo Afolabi. Ah. <laughs> I'm lost because I don't think I have the word to describe my husband. He's, he's a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful father, wonderful husband, marvelous grandfather. He's just everything, all rounder. He's always at the point of your need. And may God bless him for us because I don't think my children could have any better father than him. And I cannot have another husband than him. I didn't regret I married him. He's very wonderful. And he's even my mentor. I look on to him for everything I do because he's very hardworking and the children also look on to him. When we see him work, we work. He's a source of inspiration to all of us in this family. He's richly blessed. I pray for my husband, Taiwo Omoaisha to Afolabi. I wish him the best of birthday and uh, I pray that his next year sixty will be glorious than this. I pray that he will be in good health and sound mind. His hand or leg will not be amputated. He will be a complete man through all the days of his life. He will become 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. And the grace of the Lord will continuously shine upon his life. He will not go weak and he will not go weary. He will always be strong with sound mind. And he will continue to be in the presence of the Lord all the days of his life. In the name of Jesus. No. We are really in an exciting moment now. You know, since morning, you see the people who have been coming just to celebrate with us, to rejoice. Uh, we thank God uh, that God have, has added another year to my year. I give glory to God. I give thanks to God for what he has been doing, what he has done before, and what he's still going to do in my life and my family life. God to decide because I know that more are still coming. We are still going to break more grants, and I know where I am today. I thank God, like I told you, but we still aspire for more to come. So that's the normal thing for human being. I mean, I look back where I'm coming from, where I am today. I still give glory to Almighty God, but I know that more are still coming. More achieve achievement, you see, awaits all of not, us. Things cannot just be smooth like that. 
there are so many challenges. But what I would tell you is that we thank God for all the challenges that have been in front of us. God has been able to whittle down every challenge. Uh, do you understand what I'm saying? So that alone gives us hope that whatever we are doing, the future is more brighter than today. So whatever challenges we are facing, I know my God will take care of. That, that's the most important thing. There's nobody that I believe that is rich. I, I measure your richness based on the number of people you have put smile on their faces. So it's not just to tell me that you are wealthy. I believe that you're, you are telling me you are wealthy, you are rich. I want to know the number of people you have helped, or you have assisted, the humanity. My life is based on humanity. I'm looking up for God to do more for us. I mean, the one thing is I thank God today, we are both alive today to see the light of the day and to see many, many more years to come. So that alone gives me that excitement. Do you understand what I'm saying? So we're both alive. As I'm celebrating, he too is celebrating. I think uh, we have to thank God for what he has done for us.